All right, Matt Welch right off the mat. Third place finish, technical fall yep. of Meeks of Oregon State. I mean, you really made that look easy. Um, a mid second period technical fall. Was that a statement for, you know, from last night to uh, lose it in the semifinal? Yeah, I think that it carried, some of the emotions carried over. I was pretty mad about that loss, but f felt like I used that energy positively and came back through and made some noise in the constellation bracket. Now we're a state champion in, uh, in Pennsylvania, going to Pitt. Did you ever envision yourself as a two-time All-American? Uh, I think I said my goal going into Pitt was to be an All-American just once, you know. But I got it twice, so I exceeded my expectations. How much better does it feel to go from four to three? You know, you leave on a win last year, you left on a loss. How much better does that feel? Feels good to end my career on a win, and I, I definitely want to improve every time just to show that I'm at least progressing. To finish worse than you did a year before would be a drag. And I'm pretty glad that I ended up better than I was last year. But do you feel like you're a better wrestler? I mean, are you putting things together that you weren't able to do a year ago? Or do you feel stronger, more confident, more Matt savvy, that kind of stuff? Yeah, I'd say I've improved over all the aspects every year, and that's what uh, that's what the Pit, Pit Panthers are all about. We're just trying to get exponential growth forever. Okay, you got you stayed at home. Chartiers Valley High School. What is it? Twenty minutes from Pitt. If mm -hmm. that was it, was staying at home the right choice? Yeah, I definitely liked it. Uh, and I think that Whippeo guys look at Pitt. We got a good staff. We're going in the right direction, and we have good recruits and the team's up and coming. And it was nice being near home. Had my support groups all around me. I'm getting. Text it, text, and phone calls all, all day. So, your dad, oh, your dad wrestled on the first Randy Stoudemire coached pit team. You will wrestle yeah. on the last Randy Stoudemire pit coach team. What's that legacy, family legacy of the Wilps? You know, left at pit. What's that like? It's great. Uh, the Wilps family, we're really carving out a niche as a wrestling family, and that's a good thing because the sport demands a lot, a lot of uh, dedication, and focus, and. Uh, think that and they should put it back in the Olympics. But do you have the wrestling bug? Are you going to do any freestyle? I'm not sure what my plans are in the future. But you obviously did some uh, on your way through college. I mean, mm -hmm. that, that probably helped you a little bit because you progressed as a wrestler. Uh, Doing that, I mean, having that opportunity, man. Opportunity to, to compete in freestyle and to work uh, out. The yeah, it helped. Oh, I didn't, we didn't do as much. I, I didn't do as well in freestyle. I think I focused a lot on my conditioning and it doesn't translate as well but I would I wouldn't not be interested who knows what made Randy unique what made Randy unique he's just a, he's great he's uh he's always fr he's always friendly he's always there to encourage you he's all he has all the old time sayings to get you uh, laughing lighten the mood but still keep you focused like water off a duck's back every Stuff like that, and uh, he's re he's really a good guy, very supportive, he's a good coach. Does the two seconds from last night haunt you at all? Yes. And I mean, to degree, like how bad did it does it haunt you, or did it haunt you? Last uh, night? I can't rate it. I don't know. Okay. It's not fun. <laughs> I'm not pleased. It's four seconds. Four seconds. They okay. beat me three. I need four to win. I know the number. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Compared to the wild matches you had with Wright this year, I mean, were you, was it weird that it came down to such a tiebreaker? Yeah, it was. He, he usually opened up, opens up more, and but it's it's also the stage in the in the semifinals and nationals. But you're not going to give an inch, and you're not really going to take a big risk unless you have the opportunity to score uh, pretty easily. And I think neither of us really took huge risks. And that's why I went to double overtime. Oddly, this round, there's so much scoring, there's so many pins, there's so much. Why is that? I think it's just because people are going all out. I know this is my last match, and I just really wanted to go out there and hammer the guy. And I'm glad that I, I did. Yep, you're welcome. Tonight, finals 197, who you got? Right or Kobe? <laughs> you wrestled the guy so much. I'm going to go with Wright because he beat me. Right, because he beat yes. you? Yes. All right, hey, good luck. Congratulations, two-time All-American. Yeah, thanks.